Hey guys, welcome back. So today I have a Beautylish haul that I want to share with you. I actually placed this order, I don't know, over the weekend and I actually got it yesterday, no, a couple of days ago I believe. And I'm just now getting around to filming it. Um, I actually needed to um, get more of the Bioderma that I really liked as y'all, if y'all saw my um, uh, skincare video, my skincare products video, you'll see that I was almost out out of it actually. So anyways, um, so, so anyways, are y'all excited for fall weather? I know I am. I cannot wait. And I've got my tea, my little Halloween cup, and it says caddy without my coffee. And I think I am in the mornings when I don't have my coffee, but I did have coffee this morning and I'm actually having some chai tea right now. Mmm, so good. But anyways, let's get to the haul. And, ugh, sorry, my nose keeps itching, and I think it's this foundation. I'm not sure. I mean, I have allergies, but it's itching a lot more than normal, and I really don't want to rub off the foundation. Um, just kind of a hint, I'm trying out the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation, and I'm not really liking it. Um, I'm still kind of testing it out. It's my second time... Um, wearing it and I don't know I'm just I'm not happy with how it looks on my skin it just sits on top of my skin it looks like I have foundation on I mean at a distance it looks fine but when you're sitting next to someone or whatever it you can obviously tell I'm wearing it, it doesn't look natural it looks kind of cakey on my skin it's emphasizing um, my facial lines it's settling into my smile lines and even with setting it with powder Anyways, enough rambling. I'll talk about that in another video, but anyways, um, it actually comes in this little box, and they actually package it really nicely, and uh, it comes, you know, it looks like a, kind of like a, not really a newspaper article, but it has like, a, see, my nose keeps itchy. Uh, anyways, it kind of has like these draw figurines on this little tissue paper. In fact, let's see if I can get it out. That's what it kind of looks like, and it has like a little ribbon uh, tied around it, and then it has um, black tissue paper, and then it actually, the products come bubble wrapped, as you can see. Um, I actually ordered the 500 milliliters uh, with the pump, and then I ordered a little small travel size one, and then, um, and I'll set that down for a minute. And it actually comes with these bags. Like, this is what my Bioderma came in, and this is what my lipsticks came in. I actually ordered a couple of lipsticks. But anyways, as you can see, um, they come really nicely bubble-wrapped, or at least the Bioderma did. And they, every time I have ordered from them, they have been uh, really phenomenal with taking care of their products when um, it's being shipped. And I've never had any damage. Knock on wood. <laughs> yes, my chair's wood. So, but, um, anyway, so I like the fact that they come bubble wrapped. And as you can see, once again, I ordered the one with the pump and the small one. And then, um, let's set this box down. I ordered three different, uh, Charlotte Tillsbury lipsticks. I have three, um, let's see if you can see it. It's right there. It's so it's kind of a rose gold. I have three of them. And they're the Matte Revolutionary lipsticks, and or Revo Revolution <laughs> lipsticks. Sorry, um, and I really like those. And I ordered um, another Matte Revolution lipstick, and which one was it? Pillow Talk. And then I ordered two of the Hot Lips Matte Revolutions. I think some of them have different finishes in the Hot Lips line. I'm not sure. But anyways, and those two are Super Cindy and Kidsman's Kiss. And I have worn all three, and I'm actually wearing Pillow Talk right now. And I absolutely love it. It kind of reminds me of Urban Decay uh, Naked Lipstick, which is my absolute favorite. I am so sorry. I told you my nose is itching like crazy. I think I'm going to have to take this foundation off after I finish filming today. I've got several videos that I'm going to film today. But anyways, and I love these lipsticks. I would have to say that Urban Decay um, and Charlotte Tillsbury are my top two lipsticks that I love. And then, um, let's 
see, I can't think of what other brands would be in like my top five. But as of right now, Urban Decay and Charlotte and Tillsbury are my top five. And But anyways, I'll go ahead and swatch this one even though I'm wearing it. Oh, it's so pretty. I love it. Like I said, it reminds me so much of the Urban Decay Naked. And that's my absolute favorite. I already have backups of that. And that's what that looks like. Oh, it's so pretty. And like I said, that's the one I'm wearing today. I'm actually going to change my lip color today when I film my ColourPop haul video. Because I'm wearing ColourPop on my eyes. And on my, um, and I'm wearing the highlight as well, so, and I kind of want to put on a lip color as well, so y'all guys can see that, but that should be going up sometime this week. I'm filming that today as well. That one's going to take me a little bit longer to edit with all the swatches and whatnot, but anyways, uh, this one is Kidman's Kiss. Let's go ahead. I love this shade. It's so pretty. Oh, it's so pretty. It's kind of a pinky coral shade, nude shade, and it's that one right there. It's so pretty. It looks so nice on. It doesn't, like, you know how some of the brighter coral shades can kind of emphasize your, your lip line and stuff and kind of settle into it? This one actually doesn't. Um, it actually makes your lips look pretty good. At least it does on me. I know everyone is, is different, but it does on me, and I absolutely love the color. Although... It's more of a, like, a springtime summer color. I know I'm a little late on, on getting it, but, hey, I'm going to wear what I want to wear. And if I wear it in the fall, I'm going to wear it in the fall. <laughs> and this one is Super Cindy. I've been hearing a lot about this one, and I have worn it, and I do love it. And this one is more of a, let's see, how do I put this? A coral nude? I guess it's a nude color, but it kind of has a hint of pink coral to it. It's like a little bit darker than Kidsman's Kiss. As you can see, it's right there. And I love that. And I have worn all three, and I just, I love it. I am so glad that I was able to buy these. Um, this is what the packaging looks like. This is the one with Pillow Talk. And that one. And then um, the one with Hot Lips has that little hot lips on there and oh yeah that kind of reminds me I almost forgot I don't know if y'all could see it from here probably not but this one has like a, a lip imprint in the lipstick and I think it's so cute I don't know why they did that but I think it's so cute and another thing I forgot to mention I love these the smell of these they smell so good. Um, if you have MAC lipsticks and you love the smell of that, this reminds me so much of what the MAC lipstick smells like. And I love that smell. And it's not strong enough to where you're tasting it and it lingers. And it, as soon as you apply it, the smell goes away. But I just love how these smell. I love how these apply. These are super opaque. To me, they're long wearing and they stain my lips pretty nicely. And these are, these are actually a little bit pricey. In fact, how much are these? Let's see if they have them listed on my um, receipt here. No, they don't. Um, I'm going to say I think they're in the like the $34 range. I'm probably wrong. I actually will link the price, link the price. I'll put the price down below for sure, but... Um, I buy these, like I said, off of Beautylish.com, and and they have great customer service. They ship really fast. I get these in two days. Um, let's see, I ordered it Sunday, I believe, and I got it Tuesday or I think Tuesday. I think, yeah, because today is Wednesday. So yeah, I got this um, yesterday, I believe. I could be wrong. I get. <laughs> I can't, I don't keep up with when my packages arrive and stuff, but it's, yeah, you, if you like matte lipsticks and you don't really like to wear the liquid lipsticks, um, but you like the lipstick formula, definitely try these out. And also the Urban Decay ones are good, but the video is about these and my Beautylish order. So yeah, go ahead and get these. These are, are great. 
so yeah, that's my Beautylish haul. I'm going to go ahead and film um, some other videos. I've got a ColourPop um, haul I'm going to film. And my Ipsy bag is coming today. So, <coughs> hello. I had a little scratch in my throat. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I have an Ipsy bag coming today, so I will be unbagging that with you guys today as well. So anyways, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. That will help me out a lot. Um, please hit the notification bell if you want to be notified whenever I upload. And please hit that subscribe button, and I will talk to you guys very soon.